I'm Hideki Maeda. Uh, I'm Japanese, but I was based in UK a long time, like 20 years ish. Now I'm executive chef of Singapore for season also. So I normally start like 10 30, 11 ish in the morning. Uh, we need to check a lot of stages, delivery, chefs, events, everything, meeting. So we just need to tidy up the schedule first and then I attack like one by one. So I'm start cooking like age of 18. So first few years I was a bit confused, like a uh, lot of comics job, uh, washing, blah blah blah. But after that, when we once when we start cooking, cooking, yeah, I discover like more fun for that. And after I moved to the England, UK, and then joined to the kitchen team, I get more double passion for that. I never seen the cooking technique ingredients and then I saw the lots of different background chefs that makes me unique. Well the chef Hideki is working no more than twenty years. He knows London's, Africa's, you know now it's Singapore's. He understands the like, nobles of philosophy, even the quality of the food. Chef Hideki is a very uh, honor honorable and a very humble chef. And he's uh, really amazing to work with. And I hope to learn more from him under his guidance. So, rice is ready. So we are using the special gas cooker. Gas is the best. So, basically, break it down the sushi rice, I mean, cooked rice, to make it flat in now. And he's going to mix with the sushi vinegar. So you can see. He always using the paddle to break it down the sauces. So like every single piece of the sushi rice, they get like vinegar to cover it. It is hot, hot sushi rice. After mix with the vinegar, temperature start getting calm. But we are using sushi rice warmer. So we don't like the cold, cold rice, but not hot rice. So cool it down, it's not really cool it down, just leave as a room temperature and then we put it into the box, special box to hold in like our special temperature. That's for the lunch, we do another shot for the dinner service. Look, nice one. Best sushi is makes have to be by best fresh fish. And also we have to make sushi rice. So now we have fish and the sushi rice. So after this, have to be slice right size, about 14 or 15 grams. And sushi rice, maybe 12 grams. The between the fish and the rice, but the wasabi, fresh wasabi is the best because fresh wasabi kills the, uh, the fish bacteria. Sushi rice is the best way, kind of like a room temperature, body temperatures is the best way. Not too hot, not too cold. Make the sushi, put the soy sauce, best way eat immediately, enjoy the best. I need to order some fish for next week. Okay. Chef's table on Thursday, so I try yeah. to get everybody on Tuesday. Yeah. What's the deadline? Deadline is Friday. Friday, no? Scallop miso chip one piece and then tuna tacos, salmon tacos, salsa, fire. Okay. So now uh, slowly lunch star service starting and as you can see, still some people doing the miso plus at the back and a few people get involved for the service. 
together with like setting up and mission plus uh, we just need to get ready for the whole day anyway Nobu became a brand over the last 30 years um, it's became well known across the globe so we have mostly people come from everywhere just like a regular operations you have a guest comes in um, with the reservations mostly and very seldom we do have a walk-in guest comes in um, of course when we bring them in with a loud irashamase which means welcome in Japanese uh, language so welcome home so we bring it, them to the table our servers will bring the menu greet them just recommend some sake and beautiful wine selection which we do have here in Singapore new restaurant different setup size of the restaurant is like similar but more unique setup Main dining is make it smaller and then full private dining we have. Plus two tap and room. I never seen the noble restaurant set up like this before. Well, Singapore team is uh, pretty uh, big, I would say. From front of the house, we have uh, 22 people. Um, kitchen side, we are in back of the house, and all together, we have almost uh, 55 people working with us. Four. How about four? Forty four. I mean, almost like one o'clock, second team coming from. Yeah, to join us and carry on the mission for us take over some of the service and then we carry on for the whole day process. So first I'm, I'm running at the grill station and then running daily operation, preparing meats, cuts and then kushiyakis and then our signature black corn as well. Working in the grill, we are, we are more concerned about the, the temperature as well as the timing. And sorting station is more about speed and organization and when the operation get really busy, you really need to be very focused as well as to stay organized so that you can send out the dishes in time. So Hideki is in Singapore now, so he must understand more inside the Singapore. What the local people likes and what's the local ingredients, what's the local product, have to be much, much more research, understand more Singapore. No restaurant in the world, we have like kind of like standard menu we have to make it standard as it is. Portion size, recipe, everything we need to follow, and then we just adjust, adjust location by location. Kind of like local ingredients, and also the flavor. Some country like more spicy food, some country likes more classic Japanese style. So we adjust little by little. Second course for the lunch of Makase, Shrimp tempura creamy spicy sauce and our signature black coffee sauce. So now like kind of like end of the lunch service, uh, we are closing the little section. For the service station we close. Uh, Petri is still open, few table for the dessert, uh, the sushi bar is still going. But like uh, we are doing second team for the food mission plus and we carry on, get ready for the dinner service. So bookings, it's only 88, but it's a Thursday night, so please be expected for surprises, okay? The reservations right now, the 7 p.m., we have a 20 bags coming in. So it means obviously those 20 bags, we cannot turn back right away. So we will be having a table crunch around 8.30 people, 8.30 p.m. But the number of people we have on the floor today, good amount of service, we should be able to pull this off without any issues. So whoever gets the table at 6, 6, 15, 6, 30, let's try to push the table slightly bit more faster than what you usually do. Because 6, 30 we have 16 tables coming, 16 packs coming in. But 8, 30 we have 18 packs coming in. So the table flow for the middle, I expect to be today to be more crunched than usual. Let's make sure uh, Ricky don't run around, okay? Let's do a good team and uh, let's check our sections. Julia. Three, two, one. Go team! So 
this is a dinner service. Uh, we just started like an hour ago. And uh, now everybody in action. Uh, so also it for dishes and also the whole kitchen. As you can see, start getting busy right now. Go around 80, 90 bucks. Uh, Saturday night, it's okay. It's okay. It's not that crazy. No private function. Something pre-order, separate function. We do focus on like regular restaurant service. That's it. Cool. So this is the backyard of the kitchen. So basically service is not that happen yet. I mean dessert later. So they are still doing the mise en place for now. Endless. We prep for tonight, prep for tomorrow. We carry on as it is. So those things when they get order, going to the front to the, carry on the service. Maybe like depends on the order. Small order, go only one person in the front. And then still carry on the mise en place thing. So this is the dinner service inside the kitchen. So right now we got six people working for the hotline, grill, station. That's a working process for the cooking, cooking. So this is a typical night for the Thursday uh, during the dinner service. Lots of restaurant owner or lots of big name chef everywhere in the world. But Nobusa is like uh, chef background and he's still chef. That's what we feel. So he understand what we are doing and we respect each other. Uh, he understood what chef wanted all the time. Okay, the first one of the restaurants 1994 opened in New York. Now we have less than the five continents. So still they keep growing and uh, I like to introduce to Nobu restaurants more to the world. Um, Nobu restaurants always looking for which way more better. So never stop about this. So that's all Nobu restaurant dinner service as it is. Uh, that's a typical Thursday night today, uh, 18, 19 covers, which is fine. Uh, no special function, no complicated one. Easy, simple, straightforward service. It was good. Thank you. Then from 10, once when we get calm down for the lesson service, we start packing, clean down. Mission Plus for the next day, check the delivery and the order for the next day. So, normally it's always like challenging. So, day by day, week by week, it's like always different. I mean, most of the restaurant does uh, different things, but this restaurant got like Bigger. When I was young, yeah, I was a bit funny feeling, uh, miss everything like normal social life. I choose myself what I want. Almost my whole life is working, but that's okay. Gain something day by day. Even like one millimeter or whatever. Even small things, not only for.